Hi there, Holly Cohen, co-founder of Preferred Medicare Plans. It's open enrollment time, as we discussed before, so we are slamming busy here in my office. <clears throat> Wanted to just cover a couple topics. Um, well, one topic, Part D, D like drug. So Part D of Medicare, uh, people get very confused about that, that part of Medicare. It is, um, again, two, there are two ways to be on Medicare. There's Medicare Advantage, which includes a prescription plan inside of it. It bundles it together. Those plans do have a network like a PPO or HMO, a list of doctors and hospitals that you have to choose from. They do include the, the premium for Part D, uh, which you, is averaging anywhere from $7 to $24 this year, or actually for 2022. Um, and, and, in that scenario, when you have Medicare Advantage, you have to use whatever drug plan comes inside that Advantage plan. You, you have no choice. So for example, if your doctor accepts your Medicare Advantage plan, great. You, you know, you, you're going to have a high max out of pocket, which is $7,550 this year, and your prescription plan is included. But that doesn't mean that when you go pick up your medications at the pharmacy, that they're free. <laughs> it just means that the Medicare Advantage plan insurance company will not require you to pay a monthly premium for that Part D, the drug drug plan, which ranges from any anywhere from six dollars and ninety cents to twenty four dollars. So somewhere in between. You have to go with that drug plan if you go Medicare Advantage. You have to stay within the confines of that plan. It's very restrictive. Um, it does work for some people that have lower income or, or people that think that possibly they're getting something for free. Nothing, nothing is ever free. So Medicare Advantage plans are not free. Nothing about them is free um, unless you get financial assistance and you're real low income. Okay, so that's how, that, how Part D works within a Medicare Advantage plan program. The other way to be on Medicare, which is the way Medicare intended it to be back in 1966 when it first came out is to keep your real Medicare, your original federal government program Medicare, your A and your B as your main insurance. And it's a direct bill system, uh, meaning you take two cards to your doctor's office, you take your Medicare card and you take your Medicare supplement card and every bill is paid for. Um, now, in, in that case, which is the best way to be on Medicare, you do have to have a standalone prescription plan, also called a Part D. And again, those range in cost anywhere from $690 to about $24. Um, my office, we, we always help you with that year after year after year, understand what drug plan is best suited for you, what's going to cut your costs the, the best. Uh, it's a matter of you are, what drugs, what medications you are prescribed, what pharmacy you like to go to, and what county you live in. Those are the, the three criteria for picking your standalone Part D. We can help you with that. We can help you figure out what's your best option, whether it be Medicare Advantage or whether it be Original Medicare with a Medicare Supplement, Medigap plan, and the standalone prescription Part D plan. So call us 855-265-6334. We're standing by to help you. 855-265-6334. Preferred Medicare plans, over 25 years combined experience and happy to assist. Thanks, y'all have a great day.